Today we're going to show you our uh, on-head bell spring checker. Uh, you can see here it's got a fairly large display, a large font. That reading there is the last uh, reading we took on, on this uh, Mustang here. This is a 390 Mustang we use for developing a lot of our prototype equipment. And uh, you can see here it's got menus of options and such. And what's different about ours than anything else out there in the market is, you can see that was the last reading we took. Now I'm going to hit record. And you can see it automatically will record the next number. You don't have to feel nothing. It's doing everything for you. We got 129.1. We had 127 before. I'm going to hit it again. I'm going to get 127.1. One thirty point six. So it's all within about a couple pounds of each other. It's got tenth of a pound resolution, and uh, you can still do it manually if you want. If you want to feel for it yourself, you just uh, hit the the load button like I did there, and you can see the digital display is reading increments in tenths of a pound. You can go up there and do it that way. But what, like I said, what makes this really neat is you can press record and have it do it everything for you. There we got 126.8. So this allows anybody to very quickly go through all your springs and it doesn't matter about who's doing it, who feels it. Everybody will get the same numbers. Uh, it has options here for changing the rock arm pivot length between the, the fulcrum, center of fulcrum and the center of the valve stem. So you can just adjust it so it gives you a true reading of what the valve spring's doing for a big block Chevy rocker arm or small block Chevy or this Ford by just selecting the different pivot arm lengths. 